Danny, we followed up Saturday's emphatic win with another emphatic win here on the road at Long Eaton. Uh, you, the gaffer, and the management team, players, changing room must be very happy after that. Yeah, the lads are buzzing in there. It's been, um, you know, a good two performances as well as two emphatic wins. I mean, scored nine goals and then six, six goals here tonight. Um, as a management team, we're happy with what they've done. Um, but we've said, you know, when we came here tonight, reset button, starts all again. Previous game doesn't mean a great deal when you're going into a new game. You know, all credit to Long Eaton. They're down there scrapping at the moment, so we have to give them the respect they deserve. Um, and I think we came in and did that professionally tonight. Yeah, we'll come on to, like you said, we scored a, a bunch of goals again, but two clean sheets in a row also important because the stats don't lie. We have conceded a lot of goals this season already. Yeah. Um, but yeah, two clean sheets against teams that are down there, but you've, you've, you can only beat what you're against, as, as respectful as that is. Yeah, 100%. Um, you know, with the players we've brought in and the, the back four that we've got, you know, we expect to be doing better. You know, we should be, we should be keeping more clean sheets. And now we've started to do it. Like I said, it's been against two teams that are down there scrapping. However, like, you know, we've got to, you've got to do it. So hopefully that's the catalyst for us to kick on. Now we've got that clean sheet sorted. We're always scoring goals up at the top end with the players we've got up there. So you put the two together and you, you're going to end up with positive results all the time, aren't you? Yeah, you're right. At the other end of the pitch, um, it's been a kind of a front four in the last few games. Terrell, Tim, Luke Shaw and, and Tom McGlinchey, who probably goes under the radar because of how good he is every game. But yeah. um, some of the football and goals were, were frightening, weren't they? Yeah, unbelievable. You know, a joy to watch, even as a management team. You know, we see it in training week in, week out, but then to go and emulate that on a match day, you know, some of the, the patterns of play and, and stuff we put together, some of the individual bits of brilliance, you know, these lads, if they can continue to do that week in, week out, you know, they, they'll, they'll kick on. So um, as long as they're doing well, we're doing well. So we just, <laughs> philosophy is give them the ball and let them go and play. Is, um the word been bandied around about us this year is inconsistent, yep. but after two really good performances, is it easier said than done, I appreciate, but time to try and find some consistency? Yeah, 100%. Um, whatever's been banded around, inconsistency, the stats don't lie. You know, we've won one, lost, won a couple, lost a couple, etc., etc. It's been frustrating for all of us. You know, for whatever reasons, we've not quite got that consistency up to now. But like I said, two great wins. Can we use that as a catalyst to go and kick on for our season now? Alf Church away in the FA Trophy, uh, always a tricky test. We've had some great wins there and uh, some big defeats there. Yeah. Um, a really, really tricky game um, in the Cup against a team in our league. Yeah. Um, so yeah, away at Alva Church, it's a break from league. Um, FA Trophy, but let's go and have a run at it. You know, we won't take them lightly. We'll go there and expect a tough game. Um, but really our aim is to go on and go into the next round. And tonight you had Wes York back uh, Saturday and tonight. Ash Chambers came on to get some minutes, which was great to see. Um, and Kieran Cook back from suspension. So uh, as a management team, you've used the term a nice headache. Yeah, definitely. The squad's getting stronger. You know, players are getting back from suspensions and getting back from injuries and whatever. Um, and it gives, it, it, it breeds competition, you know, and competition breeds better performances on the pitch. If someone's not doing it, they know someone's waiting to come and take their shirt. So, you know, while we've got those players available, then it's, it's up to us to make those decisions. And just finally, really good to see the fans showing their appreciation at the end. We brought a good number on uh, over here tonight. Must must mean a lot to, to the changing room. Yeah, it means a lot. You know, the, the travelling support especially. We know it's a cold evening away at, at Long Eaton and to have that, that number of support come and shout us on and cheer us on. Um, it's massive for the boys, it gives us a lift, so, you know, long may that continue.